Hey yo, Chicksaw here. Today we're going to do Guild Boss Heart again, but this time we are not using Green Gotha, we are using Red Gotha like the good old days. This is going to be the team and it's basically the same team just like Green Gotha. The only problem is we have a lower chance to crit. So I have given SSR gear to my Gotha now. It's not really necessary. Rare still works. The one star cards will be patience. The only problem is two star cards don't patience, even with SSR. So there was no real so there was no real reason why I did that. But yeah. So if you can get the Elad ult early on, that might be helpful because yeah, that helps Gotha to patience. So the start is going to be basically the same, just like the other video, but we have to do some other stuff. First of all, if you can go for another stack, you can go for another turn. It's okay. The optimal turn is like turn seven or eight. So if we get attacked early on with the two star onto our Gotha, don't think it's a dead run right away. First of all, especially with red Gotha, if you get a decent run, take whatever run you can get. And um, if you have Tamiel 66 for example, Tamiel is definitely a better link. Uh, I don't have that, so unfortunately I can't do that. This one is not really a good start, but I like it because it's a lot of Elat cards. So um, the card might be turning out to be a good run. And maybe if like, for example, the third turn is shit, I might put out. Because yeah, our goal is obviously, if we can, getting... 10 stacks on Elat and 10 stacks on Daddy would be great. Uh, I'm honestly not sure about this run. But I will give it another turn because I almost have the stuff ready I need. Right, he will also heal up a bit so we can do this. This. And we rank up onto our Gotha. If we, for example, get another Hellbron buff, we could just merge it into a Golden, which is not that bad. LV is not the greatest link for Git Boss, I think. I'm I'm not really sure, Ivan. If 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 LV is your best geared unit though, then of course use LV as link. Okay, um he's getting really squishy, which is not good, but we're still fine. Um I will definitely use this. I will I think I can actually just dump those cards here. Yeah, and hopefully we just get a buff. A daddy buff and a rank up. That would be beautiful. That would be super rushy. So let's see. <laughs> super rushy. <laughs> okay, so we're going to do this. We're going to double rank up. The only problem though is, the only problem right now I have is that we don't have the Hellbram ult. And I'm afraid that we are going to not be able to elongate. But even if you don't have the elong uh, even if you don't have the Hellbram ult, it's not mandatory, but it takes away points. So if it's like that, you know some of your points got stolen. But please give me another daddy card. Oh damn. It's fine though, I think. So, um, what is this run? I think it's a five stack run. Also, it's unfortunate that um, Hellbrom is below 50% because yeah, if Hellbrom is higher HP, right now there's a mission with 50%. So yeah, that's the only reason. Um, five stack, how many stacks do we have on her? I think we can get, so we can get two more. We have an eight stack, five eight stack. It's not the greatest run, but it's also not a bad run, I would say. So hopefully we can get a crit. So we debuff here. And yeah, the best would have been, of course, if we would have had the ult of our Hellbrom 2. But unfortunately, we can't change this. And we got a crit in our second run. Not two, Chibi. So of course, um, it's much harder to get a run with the Red Gotha team. And if you want to make your life a bit easier, like if you don't want to um, struggle with patience, 
I'm not 100% sure. Maybe you could use resistance food together with Gotha. It might. Patience. I didn't try it out, so I can't guarantee you guys. It also depends on how good your Gotha is. If you have everything cosmetic upgraded. If your link is good. But yeah. This is how to do hard with Red Gotha. So this is what I think is the best team to use with Red, uh, with Red Gotha. We use crit damage food. Um, if you use attack food, it's a bit better. But it's harder to get a run, especially if you go for high stacks. I hope this was helpful and I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, comment, like and subscribe. Thanks for tuning in and peace out for now.